China's new radar installation on Triton Island is making waves in the South China Sea. This cutting-edge synthetic impulse and aperture radar CR system, nestled within one of the region's most contested territories, marks a strategic upgrade to China's surveillance capabilities positioned in the Paracel Islands. This radar can detect stealth aircraft and other airborne threats that traditional systems might miss. But why Triton Island, and why now? In this video, we'll explore the technology behind this radar, the strategic importance of Triton Island, and the regional and global implications of this bold move by China. Stay with us to understand how this radar could shift the balance of power in one of the world's most hotly contested regions. China's new radar on Triton Island isn't just another piece of military hardware. It's a technological leap. The radar system, known as Synthetic Impulse and Aperture Radar CR, stands out because of its VHF band operation. This band is crucial for detecting stealth aircraft, which use special materials and designs to evade detection by conventional radar systems operating on UHF or S-bands. Unlike those systems, CR's long wavelengths can detect even low-signature aircraft, making it a significant asset for tracking potential threats in the air. Satellite images reveal the octagonal structure of the CR array, similar to those found on other Chinese military bases like Subi Reef and Hainan Island. The CR system's advanced signal processing capabilities allow it to distinguish between actual targets and surface clutter, which has traditionally been a challenge for VHF radars. This makes it an effective tool for China's air surveillance network, giving it a critical edge in monitoring airborne activities across the South China Sea. The installation on Triton Island is not an isolated development, but part of a broader effort to close surveillance gaps across the region. Positioned strategically between other radar sites, Triton Island fills a crucial gap in coverage, allowing China to maintain almost continuous oversight across the region. This technological upgrade enhances China's ability to monitor military activities from other countries, adding a new layer of complexity to the regional security landscape. With CR, China has significantly boosted its radar coverage, reinforcing its claim to control the skies over the South China Sea. Why Triton Island? This question is key to understanding China's choice of location for its new radar installation. Triton Island, part of the Paracel Islands, is more than just a strategic outpost, it's a geopolitical hotspot. Situated roughly 250 kilometers from Vietnam's coast, Triton Island offers a vantage point for monitoring regional air and maritime activities. The island's location allows China to extend its surveillance reach over a large portion of the South China Sea, including areas near Vietnam's exclusive economic zone ease. The island's significance isn't only about proximity to Vietnam. Triton Island serves as a critical link between China's existing military installations on Subi Reef and Hainan Island. By placing CR on Triton, China effectively bridges gaps in its radar coverage, achieving a more seamless and expansive surveillance network. This interconnected network allows China to track activities that might otherwise slip through the cracks, reinforcing its ability to maintain a watchful eye over the entire region. Triton Island's strategic position also provides China with a stronger foothold over crucial shipping lanes in the South China Sea. This area is one of the world's most vital maritime routes, with over a third of global shipping passing through it. Control over this region gives China leverage not only in military terms but also in economic influence, as it can monitor and, if needed, exert pressure on commercial shipping activities. This is especially significant given the competition for regional dominance with other powers like the United States and India. Historically, Triton Island has been a flashpoint between China and Vietnam. In 2014, the deployment of a Chinese oil rig in nearby waters triggered a fierce standoff with Vietnam highlighting the strategic value of the region's rich oil and gas reserves. The installation of this radar system hints at China's ongoing interest in securing these resources, making Triton Island a focal point for future geopolitical tensions. By enhancing its surveillance capabilities here, China sends a clear message it is prepared to defend its interests in the South China Sea, both economically and militarily. 
China's activities on Triton Island also challenge international norms regarding freedom of navigation and regional stability. By asserting control over a disputed area and deploying advanced military infrastructure, China signals its willingness to maintain a strong presence in the face of international criticism and opposition. This makes Triton Island a critical piece in China's broader strategy to project power and secure its claims in this highly contested region. The radar installation on Triton Island isn't just a regional affair, it has far-reaching implications that resonate across the South China Sea and beyond. For neighboring countries like Vietnam, this advanced radar system near its ease represents a direct challenge. Vietnam, which has its claims over parts of the Paracel Islands, sees this as an encroachment on its territorial waters and airspace. With the ability to detect Vietnamese air and sea movements, China's new radar system could limit Hanoi's ability to operate discreetly in the area, raising tensions. The Philippines and Taiwan are also wary of China's expanding presence in the region. While the Triton Island radar may not directly target them, the implications of an enhanced Chinese surveillance network are concerning. The advanced radar system adds another layer to China's military capabilities, making it more challenging for these nations to navigate the delicate balance of power in the region. This could influence how these countries, along with other ASEAN members, strengthen their own defense capabilities and alliances, especially with the United States and other Western powers, to counterbalance China's presence. Internationally, the United States has been particularly vocal about China's activities in the South China Sea. The U.S. frequently conducts freedom of navigation operations phone ops through these contested waters to challenge China's territorial claims, a practice that could become more risky with China's improved radar capabilities. The CR installation on Triton Island allows China to better track U.S. naval activities, potentially escalating encounters between the two powers. This raises the stakes for both sides, as the presence of advanced radar could lead to misinterpretations or accidental clashes, further destabilizing an already tense region. This radar installation is more than just a technological upgrade, it's a signal of China's long-term strategy in the South China Sea. As Beijing bolsters its ability to monitor the region, the global community is left wondering what's next. Will this move trigger a new wave of territorial disputes? or is it a calculated step toward asserting China's dominance over one of the world's most crucial maritime corridors? It's clear that Triton Island could become a flashpoint in the evolving geopolitical struggle, with far-reaching consequences for the balance of power in the Indo-Pacific. In this video, we have learned about China's installation of an advanced anti-stealth radar system on Triton Island, its strategic significance, and its regional and global implications. We hope you learned something new. If you did, please give us a like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. And don't forget to leave a comment below and tell us what you think about this news and what you would like to know more about. We would love to hear from you. Thank you for watching and see you next time.